Ayan. I won't be sharing this to you kasi makikita nyo naman to sa aming YouTube channel. Sige, sino nga ba si Phil Global? Ayan. So, Phil Global Immigration Service Corporation is an ISO certified 9001-2015. So, I'll be discussing more about this ISO certification later na po. So, we are a world class company that started out in London last August 11, 2014. And eventually po, na-branch out tayo sa Philippines. We offer immigration and university placements to the UK, New Zealand, Spain, Australia, Canada, and US po. So we are consist of a variety of professionals from distinct sectors of industry. So bakit kami nandito? To provide you people from all walks of life a stepping stone to achieve your dreams, to study, work, and eventually live overseas. So yan. Our legacy, with over 15 years of experience in legal, so baka natanong, Yung bakit 15 years, ikaka-start lang namin 2014. So this is um, the ex um, combination of the legal, marketing, recruitment, and business consulting combined. Field Global is proud of its personal value for money. Ibig sabihin po, alam namin dito na bawat sente mong ilalabas po natin, pinaghirapan nyo po. So we see to it na may paroroonan siya. Okay? We focus on always putting you, our dear customers, interest at our heart. So Feel Global is committed to embrace the corporate values of compassion, integrity, and excellence in all of our business transactions. Ayan. Our mission to become a world leader in university placements and immigration services. In fact, by 2030, we envision that um, with 1,000 branches, we'll better the lifestyle and move forward to sustainable careers of our 100,000 members worldwide. Yes. So um, our ethos, uh, Field Global Po, is governed with these three important values. Number one is compassion, our love, devotion, and care to our clients and stakeholders. Second, our integrity. So we see to it that we provide you our best professional services with honesty and dignity. We do things right, not because we think it is right, but because we think it is morally correct. And excellence po. So we bring forth outstanding practices and management and services with achieving results. Ibig sabihin po, may resulta po ang ating mga ginagawa dito. Ayan. So as I've mentioned, Tina, I am proud to say that I am I'm part of a company, the first and the only immigration company that is ISO 9001-2015 certified. What is with um, ISO certification? So, first and foremost, ito po yung aming seal. Ayan. Hindi po, as I mentioned kanina, hindi po lahat may um, ISO certified seal. Piling-pili po. Ayan. So, this is our certification. It shows that Field Global will not just serve you with the heart, but of course, with quality management system. So, ibig sabihin, hindi lang um, alagang puso, kundi lip. Kung hindi quality din po ang serbisyo matatanggap niya with Field Global. We also have the Top Choice Award for Excellence. So Philippine Top Choice Awards for Excellence and Outstanding Achievers for 2021. O diba, Bongga, you can see here that maaasahan niyo po si Field Global. We don't just exist for the sake of existing, but of course, to give you the best service we could. We also have this qualified ICEF agency. This is another N um, NGO po that provides and supports international students or international studies. And of course, accredited po tayo sa JSANZ. This is a joint accreditation system of Australia and New Zealand, especially for our clients who are planning to go to Australia or New Zealand. And our legalities. To ensure po that Field Global Immigration Services Corporation provides high quality legal and immigration services to all our clients. We commission services from the most qualified, yes, you heard me right, po. the most qualified and experienced lawyers and top education providers and universities across the globe. In, in fact, we are in partnership with experienced immigration, immigration lawyers in United Kingdom, Denmark, New Zealand, Canada, and Australia. Our legal documents. So as you can see, po, um, hindi po tayo under PUEA bucket. Kasi si Field Global is not a recruitment agency. Thus, hindi po tayo napapasas ng work visa. But to see to it that we are legit, we are um, under, uh, we're certified under the Securities and Exchange Commission. 
in your screen po, you can see our company registration number, CS 2017-21718. Also, we have our business permit from the City of Manila, our City Hall OR, and our zoning OR. Again, so let's meet our directors, partners, and our legal counsel. First, our managing director. So our managing director, Sir Birch Ian and Ranes. A little background lang po. So isa din po siya sa mga nag-apply through student visa po to UK. And imagine lang beses siya na scam. He was scammed twice. Yes, you heard me right. Dalang beses po siya na scam. So he promised himself na ayaw niya na pong maulit ito sa mga fellow kababayans niya. That's why the birth of Phil Global Immigration. So in the background, makikita po natin that um, Sir Burge has a degree of um, Bachelor of Science in Nursing, a diploma in Health Policy and Public Health, Master's in Public Health, and of course, Master's of Science in International Hospitality in Cardiff Metropolitan University. We also have Sir Joseph B. Basta, so he is Director of Finance and Administration. So on your screen, makikita niyo po ang kanyang um, background. Diba? So, ibig sabihin, alam alam po nila ang kanilang mga ginagawa. And of course, Attorney Ernelson Trujillo. Bakit nga ba kasama natin si Attorney? So, just in case you need um, help in cases na kailangan niyo pong mag-present sa court or, yeah, he is with Phil Global to prove presentation in civil and criminal cases to leading a company and supporting compliance and litigation efforts. Ayan. So, our immigration advisors and lawyers, Let's meet our partner in United States. We have Mark Finlayson in Australia, Mark Welch Mara. We have also a partner in UK, Damian Krasner, Jiang Zhang in Canada. Another partner in the US, we have Jesse Marchan. Canada, Ali Belbaker, Attorney Gaspari naman in Italy. And of course, in New Zealand, we have Tunet Cruz Zhang and Miss Aluz Bayoko. And our Feel Global Amazing Team. So before COVID, we have face-to-face -face events po. So aside from having fun, doon po namin um, pinag-uusapan paano namin mas masiservisyohan po kayo ng maayos. And also, we have our university partner visits. Ibig sabihin po, masya hands-on po ang ating mga boss. Binibisita po nila ang ating mga clients na nasend off na kung saan bansa at saka kung saan lugar sila nandoon just to check po na okay po ang kanilang kinalalagyan at kinaroroonan. Ada ba? Our clients send off pictures. Ayan. So, we are also giving free wines and jackets. Wine for celebration. Jacket kasi nga naman malamig ang pupuntahan nyo. So, ayan. These are the amenities. So, as I said, napakaganda po ng ating um, conductal accommodation at sea residences. Malapit din po siya sa Mall of Asia. Diba? Or our field global branches. So at the moment, ang operational lang po ang ating head office. We have our national sales manager, Mr. Adam Jan Sakalayag. We call him Sir Janset. Our regional sales manager, Ms. Jaya Marita Lubag. Our assistant regional sales manager, acting, Ms. Juridic Galeaganas. Our digital sales team leader, Ms. Rochelle. And our Manila head office, this is, as mentioned, ito yung operational natin. So you can contact Ms. Jasmine Andrada. So sa mga nanonood natin na nasa Manila lang po, please visit our office at 2nd floor, Times Plaza Mall, UN Avenue, Corner Taft Avenue, Ermita, Manila. We also have branch in Baguio, but um, naka-work from home status po tayo. So for those, our friends from Baguio, you can um, contact Sir George Maxano na sa Screen nyo po ang aming mga numero. Ms. Cebu, Ms. Shello, Daniel, Ms. Pearl, just dependent visa, business visa, spousal visa, fiancé visa, GSM visa, and G1 internship. So as I've mentioned, we don't process work visa since we are not a recruit. But I'll be pressing more of the student visa. Because Canada is so open po ngayon. In fact, there um I think 1,000 immigrants ang kinakailangan nila, de ba? So ganon sila ka open. And as with the student visa po, like for example, si hubby nyo or boyfriend nyo, pwede niyo silang i-declare as dependent. 
to qualify sila as dependent visa. What's with dependent visa? Sa mga dependents po natin, they can work full time. Samantala, naman po natin, we can work. Kaya ngayon, we can, um, our students, international students, can work up to 40 hours per week. Diba? So to know more about the services, please do contact your marketing executive. Ayan. Of course, we have JVB Partner and Tours. These are our partners. If you need training, don't you worry. We have Phil Global English Academic Center for a place to stay with Philippine residences. For your essential needs, so we have FG Essentials. And for a place to celebrate, we have Wine and Cheese Cafe, JVB Wine and Cheese Cafe. Ayan. Our recognition. So we are recognized by the Arbutus College in partnership with the EDUCO or Education Connected. It is another NGO for that supports international studies. Ayan. Also, we are partnered with Ascenda, schools like um, Toronto School of Management, Niagara College Canada, Ayan. UMBC, Vibe College, Bow Valley, what else? Cambrian College of Arts and Technology. We have BC. Bay River, Winnipeg, so and dami nating school partners. Ayan. In fact, on your screen right now, you can see the logos of the partner schools na meron tayo. What if yung partner school ko ma'am eh hindi pa po partner ni Phil Global? Don't you worry? We can partner with them po. ba? So sabi nga namin, commitment po namin na makatulong na matupad nyo ay yung mga pangarap. Ayan. So, client testimonials. More of this po about Field Global um, and testimonial videos, our sign up videos, our school partner videos. Please visit our YouTube channel, click and subscribe, Field Global Immigration Services Corporation. Ayan. So, ano nga ba, or how can Field Global help you to reach your dreams? Answer is by providing you with the following. Number one po is guidance and assistance during the entire application process. Access to our lawyers if necessary. We also have unlimited IELTS review assistance. And of course, step-by-step -step embassy application assistance and guidance. We also have free counseling on qualification and options of countries to go to. We have scholarships, discounts, and loan options. And of course, at least 20 country programs to choose from from different programs per country. Ibig sabihin na, for example, sa Canada. Sa Canada po, marami tayong partner schools. And each partner schools po, marami tayong programs na pwedeng pag-usapan. For short, we will help you make that, uh, that choice to be closer to your goal. Or membership fee inclusions. Pag nakapag-decide kayo magpa-member ni Field Global, I can't um, disclose here magkano po um, during the consultation po natin yan pag-usapan. But ito po yung mga freebies natin or our inclusions. Number one, free two days and one night condo hotel accommodation. Nakita nyo na po kanina, napakaganda ng ating condo hotel. We have free visa assessment for visa application and immigration consultation. Lifetime membership and company support. I would like to stretch out about sa ating lifetime membership. Ibig sabihin po, um, for example, nasa Canada na kayo and you wanted to apply for another visa, tourist visa, kasi gusto niyo pong gumala sa Amerika, Phil Global will still be your partner po. ba? Free university school placement for student visa. Uh, we have the school letter offer, sponsorship assistance, free accident insurance for 200000 for a year, consultations with Phil Global Unlimited with free info packs for a year, free medical consultation up five times. We also have this free psychiatric counseling up to five times, free financial planning, free IELTS review and review materials. So, wala pa naman po naloka sa mga clients natin. Magkailangan natin ng psychiatric counseling, especially po sa clients natin may tinatawag na, na homesick, o ba? or adjustment sa bagong lugar. We also have um, more re um, review materials such as a free um, Duolingo, Nursing CBT, and HTPC UK registration for our PT, MT, and our OT. Yan. We also have this occupational test of English Review for our New Zealand and Australia applicants, free travel itinerary, free bottle of wine from JBB Wine and Cheese Cafe, free legal advice, and of course, free po yung RT-PCR test natin para sa ating, para po sa ating mga international students. Ayan. Accommodation assistance in the county of your choice. You also have airport cup arrival, airport send of departure, travel discounts and perks, hotel booking and discounts. Investment and remittance advice, national insurance registration assistance, and many for um, 
straightforward recommendations. Ibig sabihin po, pag hindi po bagay sa atin yung program, sasabihin po namin sa inyo, diretsyo. Ayan, walang paligoy-ligoy, walang patumpik-tumpik. We also have this big savings and professional fees, nursing cancer registration assistance in the country of your choice. What more? We have account opening assistance in a foreign bank, CRB or criminal record beer processing assistance, Philippine money remittance, and part-time job profile assistance. Field Global does not provide the jobs po and Field Global does not guarantee that members will pass their job interviews. Ibig sabihin, nasa makamay niyo po iyan. Our benefits of consultation. So for those na hindi pa po nag-proceed um, nag for consultation, bakit nga baka namin kayo pinupush for consultation? Sa consultation po kasi natin pag-uusapan in details the financial requirements and many more. For short, Get to know the countries and programs in which you are most qualified with. So, do natin pag-uusapan ano yung best program na match po sa inyo. So, um, on your screen po, this is an example ng other consulting agencies. Ibig sabihin po, ang ibang, I'm sorry, ang ibang consulting agencies po, you need to pay 1,500 per consultation. Again, 1,500 per consultation. Imagine limang beses kang napakonsult. That will cost you a total of 7,500. And with every, with every consultation, kailangan nyo po ng information pass. Imagine, you need to pay 500 pesos per every information pack. So, that will cost you a total of 10,000 pesos. Yan po with other agencies, other consulting agencies. But the good 500 pesos, you will enjoy limited consultation for a year. Yes, you have unlimited information pack valid for a year. O ba? Bongga. And of course, the EWAS camp, you'll get in touch personally with, excuse me, with our sales manager and managing director by support group. So, ibig sabihin po, pag naposite ng consultation, gagawa po tayo ng support group. Saan? Sa pabor po sa inyo, through Facebook, Viber, Skype, or Messenger. Ayan. And of course, you'll enjoy some free to Get to know more about this under 1,500 pesos consultation fee, either in video, PNB, BPI, GCash, Pay, Maya. So on your screen, po, and then po, you can take a picture or it from your marketing executive. Join us today. Book your consultations today. That is all. Thank you so much for listening. Okay, so thank you so much, Ma'am Jessa Itong. So right now, let's have our country manager from Coast Mountain College, Miss Anna Pokong. Hi, Ma'am Anna. Good afternoon. Hi, good it's afternoon. So um, um, <laughs> uh, it's cloudy here, so uh, I think it's going to rain. But wow. yeah, um, I'm very happy and excited no, to uh, share with you our um, institution, Coast Mountain College. So, shall I start, Nadim? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Let me go ahead and share my screen. Second. All right. So, kita ba siya? Okay, so um, good afternoon, um, everyone. So, those who are watching live sa ating uh, Facebook page, hello po sa inyong lahat. So, uh, let me talk about Coast Mountain College or CMTN. Okay, so... Um, will not be playing the video, please do uh, visit our YouTube channel, Coast Mountain College, for uh, videos about our programs, life, uh, student life experiences, and uh, 
among others, yung mga programs din namin. We do have our videos there. All right, so um, here's our province, British Columbia or BC. So if you see the regions are numbering, number two is the Lower Mainland. This is Vancouver. So we are not located in Vancouver. We are located here in number six, which is the Skeena region. So uh, we have three campuses um, that are accepting international students. So we have campuses in the city of Prince Rupert, city of Terrace, which is the main city, and then Smithers. So from the point of entry, which is Vancouver, you take 1.5 hour flight going to the city of Terrace. And then from there, um, you may have, uh, you will uh, travel by land or by sea going to Prince Rupert or by land going from Terrace to Smithers. And uh, in the Northwest region, you get to experience all four seasons. So kung gusto nyo ng balance ng weather, uh, Northwest region is the perfect no, place for you. So this is uh, during winter, fall, summer, Yan, parating na yung summer, no? So, uh, you'll be able to, students will be able to experience yung uh, ganda ng, ng summertime sa Northwest region. This is a top view shot of the city of Terrace. So, um, the population is about 15,000. Napakaliit pa lang po. So, if you notice, um, the region is uh, surrounded surrounded by mountains, rivers, and oceans. And if you are imagining Baguio, Benguet, yan, yung mga mountainous region natin dito sa Pilipinas, this is how it looks like, no, sa northwest region. And this is our terrace campus. So this coming fall 2022, which, by the way, we still have slots for all of our international programs, Fall 2022, it's still available. So this is the main campus. And let me go ahead and tour you to our uh, Terrace campus. Hi, my name is Jessica Scaife and I'm part of the recruitment team here at Coast Mountain College and today we're going to take you on a tour of the Terrace campus. I'm standing in front of the main registration building which is called Wapsiam, also known as House of Spruce. This is where you will find our student services team, our admissions officers, our records department and it's where you can register for classes. It's also where most of our regular classes are offered. Now we're standing in Wapsiam and this is where where you'll find our student services team, which consists of educational advisors, learning assistance specialists, accessibility service coordinators, as well as the recruitment team. Okay, so this is our admissions and registration area of the college, and this is where you can come and pay for your tuition, you can pay for your dorm rent, you can order transcripts. We have our admissions officers down the hallway, as well as our financial aid officer and our student records team. So also in the House of Spruce, we offer our health programs. We have two state-of-the-art health labs, and we offer a healthcare assistant program, an access to practical nursing program, as well as an RN nursing program. This is one of two health labs at Coast Mountain College. This is our biology lab, so our anatomy and physiology classes, as well as our micro microbiology classes, take place in this lab. This is our second science lab, and this is for our chemistry and physics programs, as well as our geography and geology programs. This is our yurt. Its circular design lends itself to active learning and class discussion. It's located in the courtyard between Wapsom and Wapak. This is our campus store. It's located in Wapak, also known as House of Birch. It's where you can get your textbooks and supplies for your classes, as well as Coast Mountain College swag. Wapak is also where you find our student union, as well as the cafeteria. Okay, this is our Wapgatsap community house, and inside you'll see world-class art that was created by our Frida Deezing students, as well as instructors. Our longhouse is home to our First Nations Access Coordinators, and it's where we host orientation, campus feasts, as well as uh, cultural activities on campus. This is Wat Frida Deezing. This is home to our First Nations Fine Arts program. This program is a carving program that transfers into third year at Emily Carr's Bachelor of Fine Arts. 
This is our Wap Amgam, also known as House of Cedar. This is where you'll find our Cedar Cafe, our library, as well as our fitness facility and our trade shops. So we offer electrical, carpentry, automotive, heavy duty mechanics and welding, and many more trades at this campus. This is our fitness center, where you will find a variety of workout equipment, including free weights and spin bikes, as well as treadmills and rowing machines. Thanks for joining me on our tour of the Terrace campus today. If you have any questions about applying or registering for courses at Coast Mountain College, please email recruitment at coastmountaincollege.ca. All right, so that is our Terrace campus. So for those of you who are planning to uh, enroll this fall 2022, that's the campus that uh, you'll be studying at. All right, so um, this is our Prince Rupert campus. It's by the coast. So during winter or January intake, um, students will be studying here. And the, the campus is just a walking distance to our downtown area, so very accessible. Next is our Smithers campus. So um, our May 2022 intake has been closed already since December. So um, yeah, um, this one, uh, most of the Northwest people during winter, uh, winter time, they go here in Smithers to have their winter sports. Okay, and this is, um, this was taken during our fall 2021 orientation week, just happened September 2021. So here's our Filipino students. And um, they, they came from different regions, uh, Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao. So uh, this was um, held at our longhouse. If you um, see the, the video earlier, the longhouse, this is where orientation happens. So these are the programs. So we offer international students. We do have post degree diploma, university credit, certificates, and um, diplomas. So, uh, if you are into environmental science or ecology um, or natural sciences, uh, you may want to consider applying our applied coastal ecology to your diploma. And uh, business administration, this fits our uh, K to 12. K to 12 graduates, or those who would want to concentrate um, on our specializations, such as the accounting, general management, and human resources. For some cases, we do accept uh, undergraduates, those who have completed their first two years in college. So post-degree diploma business, uh, this is one of the in-demand programs. Actually, most of the Filipino students are taking post-degree post diploma. This is also our lowest tuition fee we offer for our international students. And um, as I've mentioned, um, this is available for our fall 2022 intake. Early childhood care and education, we do not offer this for fall 2022, but we are offering social service worker for one year certificate or two year diploma. So if you have background in nursing or in teaching or um, you're working in the community service industry, then you might want to um, take our social service worker. West Coast Culinary, uh, we accept grade 10, okay, for or, or high school graduate for our old curriculum. And uh, it's a paid internship. And uh, the second for the second year, the tuition fee is lower. Okay. And uh, culinary is one of the in-demand industries in, in BC and across Canada. So uh, for those of you who are interested in our West Coast Culinary Program, this is also still available for our fall 2022 intake. Engineering for our K-12 graduates or graduating K-12, um, we are offering one-year certificate. For those of you who are still undecided uh, which field you're taking, right, in, in, in the engineering. Um, so uh, this is offered only during fall. So again, slots are still available for fall 2022. 
university credit program, we have associate degrees in arts and science. And so if you are in the future would like to consider uh, taking a university degree in Canada, you uh, may uh, enroll to our associate degree first, okay, for two years. And after that, it depends if you want to um, continue your university degree, you just have to take it for two more years and you get four year bachelor's degree. Now, in some cases, uh, what our international students does is that they, um, after they completed their associate degree, they will have their three-year PGWP. And then once they are already a uh, permanent resident of Canada, then they continue their university degree because the tuition fee is already under domestic rate. You know? So, mas mura na siya. And still, you get to have a four-year bachelor's degree. At the same time, you have an associate diploma from Coast Mountain College. And for those who will be enrolled for fall 2022, we are offering 30 International Student Entrance Award valued at 2,200. So we do have eligible programs for this um, uh, entrance award. So uh, you may want to check it out. It, visit our website, Coast Mountain College, for more um, details about um, this uh, 30 International Student Entrance Awards that we will be offering for our um, international students who will be enrolled for fall 2022. Okay, so um, one of the highlights of Coast Mountain College is Based learning what field school. So in the field, we this commonly known as summer school. So for two weeks, students will be out of their classroom, uh, depending on the program. Okay, that the location uh, depends on on the the program. It's on the program you belong. So you will have fun. Okay, outdoor, but at the same time, you will gain credits. So this um, field school, once registration is up, you know, it easily fills out the, um, the registration because they're very, very um, excited to join. So uh, why choose Coast Mountain College? We are a small class size. So Average class size is between 12 to 32. The most is 35. So there's really more one-on-one -on -one time with your instructors. Second is that we are connected small communities. So um, people are well connected. And as I've mentioned, um, we are located in a non-metropolitan area. So um, uh, as I've mentioned, people are well connected. And we do honor and respect our indigenous people, our First Nation people, our Filipino community is already growing. Okay, 97 international students remain in the region. One is because they have found jobs. Okay, so um, we have 100% um, job uh, for our uh, Filipino students. No, we all of our um, Filipino Pinoy, our Pinoy graduates um, have jobs after they completed their um, programs. Second is that, you know, they have brought their families with them. They brought their spouses, even the whole family, their kids. So um, it is a place where, you know, raising a family, you know, it's it's very good to raise the family in the Northwest region uh, because the cost of living is low and uh, um, your children's education is free up until senior high school. So, um, either with bringing your family with you, then, uh, yeah, Northwest region is something that you can look forward to you know to, to to live and as well as to work because um our our students um spouses you know just within 
a month of, of um, landing sa Canada, sa Terrace, or sa other parts ng Northwest region, they already have uh, jobs. Okay? And um, also, um, if you are a nature lover, no, and you want a place that, you know, is away from from busy city life, from the traffic, and you just want a laid-back lifestyle. No, because the people here, most of the people here, what they love to do is that, you know, they, they love um, they love to go on biking, trekking, camping. So really more on talaga sa, sa nature, no? And um, there's nothing much to spend in the region, you know, but everything is complete, okay? So um, if your short-term goal is to, you know, to, to study, to be able to study in Canada where the institution is designated, where in your, your school is a designated um, learning institution like Coast Mountain College, and, you know, your budget is, um, your your funds is within your budget lang, you know, and uh, low tuition fee and with job opportunities, then you might want to consider living in the Northwest region and the Coast Mountain College. Later on, we'll talk more about um, the minimum wage kasi ito yung exciting. No? So, uh, we do not, um, we we, we waive IELTS for K-12 graduates and those who have definitely bachelor's degree. And for some cases, we also waive uh, those who have completed their first two years in college. So we do not require any medium of instruction as well. Okay, So as long as you um, meet this requirements, this English language requirements, then you won't be needing any IELTS. Admissions process, very easy. We do it online at Edge Planner BC. Uh, we have a 100 Canadian dollar application fee, but because Field Global is our partner agent, they'll be able to waive the application fee for you guys. So uh, once we receive the online application, we will then um, ask you to submit the basic um, requirements. Okay, so for our um, most of the students who are taking the basic programs, like you know the business program, which is very in demand in the very in demand to our Filipino um, international students, we just need your transcript of records and your diploma. Okay, a scanned copy of your transcript of records and diploma. And well, if you have your um, <coughs> high school diploma or Form 137, that's okay. Um, but yeah, for K-12, to we would be needing that, the, one, the Form 137 and your high school diploma. But for our um, college uh, graduates, just your TOR and your diploma will do for evaluation. And once you're with that, um, you have been approved of the program, then we will be asking you to pay the uh, non um, the uh, non refundable tuition deposit of seven thousand five hundred Canadian dollars. So that includes your first year um, tuition fee, okay, and your temporary insurance from Gardney. So um, we already ensure that your first three months while you're um, processing your own insurance, you already have your temporary insurance from Gardney. And uh, you might wondering or you might be asking what will be the um, what, what will be the reason for the refund only if there's visa refusal. But other than that, if everything is smooth, everything is okay, then we will then process your letter of application or the LOA. So once you receive your LOA, Phil Global will be able to process your study permit. All right, so here's the platform where we um, submit the online application. 
And then we have our on-campus housing. We have our newest three-story um, student housing in Terrace. So if you guys want to just um, you know, you, you want to get a feel of the area first, you can consider um, our on-campus housing. But most of our students, they're living off campus, okay? So near their part-time job. So they're in the downtown area. So here are the ranges, okay, for the accommodation. Uh, we have students, well, last fall 2021, we have two groups who rented a two to three bedroom house. So I think they got it between 18 to 2,000 Canadian dollars. So they're a group of four and five. So um, very cheap. So, uh, and also if you plan to bring your families with you, your spouse and your kids, then yeah, the, the two to three bedroom house will suit you. So for um, housing inquiries, you may want to email a colago at coastmountaincollege.ch. So that's Anjo. Anjo is an alumni of Coast Mountain College and he's from Cebu. Okay, He took post-degree diploma in business administration. All right, so here are some of the um, establishments where our student international students are having their part-time jobs. So some, um, some are working in the hotels, in the restaurants, fast food chains. So uh, there are really jobs, okay? There are really um, enough jobs for our international students. As I've mentioned, there are about 15,000 people pa lang po sa Northwest region and you see how big the North Northwest region is. So um, take advantage of that. So um, here's our international program fee per year. So uh, depends on depending on your program, okay, the, the fee ranges or the tuition fee ranges uh, between 12,500 to 16,000 Canadian dollars. And some programs requires um, additional elective courses, so it requires additional fees. And textbooks and supplies is at two thousand. Maximum is maximum textbook and supplies fees at two thousand Canadian dollars. But most of our international students or our Pinoy students are actually buying used books from our former students. So total program fee per year um, ranging from 15,000 to 90,000 Canadian dollars uh, per year. So this is subject to change. Okay, so all of our programs are PGWP eligible. So if you are, most of our Filipino students are really uh, taking the, or are they taking the two year program? Okay, because it's, it is equivalent to up to three years post graduation work permit. So as we all know, our long-term goal, okay, most of our uh, international students, uh, their long-term goal is to become a permanent president of Canada. So they're taking advantage of the three years post-graduation work permit. So within that span of three years, they can apply for the permanent residency. All right, so uh, part-time work. So 20 hours per week. Okay, and if it's holidays like Christmas or summer, uh, summer breaks, students will have unlimited hours. So right now, we are happy to say that um, just last June 2021, we have just increased our um, current hourly rate. Okay, it's this is just the minimum, 15.20 per hour. So this is across British Columbia. So even if you are residing in Vancouver, you know, um, you still get the same um, rate, okay, across British Columbia. So just imagine how happy our Filipino students are here in the Northwest region because as I mentioned, they, you know, they, there's job opportunities, low cost of living, low tuition fee and at the same time they have um a high 
hourly rate. Some of our students are earning more than the minimum wage. Okay, so depende yon sa kanilang work. But the minimum is 15.20. So um, just do the math. Okay, so um, especially if, you know, this coming summer, talagang most of our uh, Pinoy students hato talaga sila sa, sa, sa kanilang summer job. Because it's unlimited, and uh, you know, some of our students, sinasabi nila sa akin that um, you know they're really um, excited, no, pag summer na, kasi nga because of this um, minimum wage na 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 because of increase of the minimum wage, they are able to save up for their tuition fee for their second year no so usually what our students does is that they save up now for their first year okay the tuition fee for the first year is alone is prepared now okay para when they go to canada and when they already have their part-time jobs their part-time pay will um you know will will go to their personal expenses like you know sa, sa accommodation nila sa food and then come the second uh come the summer time na no summer summer break na since it's unlimited you know they they really save up for the tuition fee for the for the following year or for their last year na sa program and more so with our um you know, the spouses of our students, dahil nga unlimited hours sila, um, they, get, they also get to enjoy, you know, yung ating minimum wage na 15.20. And uh, some of the spouses are also uh, earning more than the minimum wage. So, uh, yeah, um, this is uh, good news kasi we see the trend, no, that it, the, the the minimum wage is increasing from time to time. So here's our student service um, we offer to our uh, students. I'd like to emphasize the learning assistance specialist or the LAS um, team. So if our students are having difficulty with their homeworks, let's say they're having um, hard time doing their math assignments and or yung mga essay writing, then they can just send a message to our LES team and within 24 to 48 hours, they'll be able to respond. All right, so uh, let's get to meet March, our international student. So um, very inspiring Kenyan story. So let's go ahead and watch this. Hi, my name is Marjolu Balili from Uzami City, Misamis, Occidental, Philippines. I am an international student taking a post-degree business diploma at Coast Mountain College. It is my dream to come in Canada and I have, I have given the opportunity to study at Coast Mountain College and I want to experience how to be an um, international student. I came here with my husband and I have two kids that has been stuck in the Philippines due to COVID and I have my aunt here who lives over like 20 years. I personally work at a &W, so it's a fast food restaurant. I choose um, a and uh, because I work before at a fast food restaurant way back home. We arrived here in Terrace days after when they locked the border. We did like self-isolate for 14 days so we travel like away from like people so we went um driving for like six to eight hours and we got to see bears caribou deer and moose as well every experience that i had in canada are memorable it's my first time to see the snow it's my first time to drive on a four-wheel vehicle <laughs> and like it's because I um, I love to travel and like go on adventure that I haven't experienced way back home because it's so expensive. It was not hard for us because there are a lot of Filipinos and international students um, who's living in Terrace and I don't feel like homesick 
it's because like I have friends like who came from the place where I can communicate with the same language Terrace is the best place that I could recommend for international students to start The cost of living is so cheap and there are a lot of Filipinos to help you to start Alright, so that is March. So, quoting trivia lang about March, no? March is supposed to um, complete her uh, program next year pa, no? Next year pa. But um, since uh, March continuously uh, study while still working no summer, so nitong um, August, she was able to complete her program. So, um, and uh, right now she's re remember the story. Na no, ang part time job niya is sa A and W. So right now she's 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 now um, absorbed by A and W as uh, one of the team leaders. So napakagandang um, experience yaan. And also, um, I am so happy that today. We will be joined by one of our alumni. Remember, I, I, guys, I mentioned about um, our housing coordinator, Anjo. So I'm happy to say that he's here right now, and she'll he'll be giving some, um, he'll be sharing some experiences. No, napaka rare to that <laughs> um, he's still awake. So yeah, um, let's hear it from Anjo. Hi. Do, do I have to show my face? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, Kite in bed over there. Hi, Angel. I'm in my bed. <laughs> Hi. How are you, everyone? Um, hi, I am Angel. I, I am the current student housing coordinator here at Coast Mountain College. I am based in Terrace, British Columbia. Um Unfortunately for Coast Mountain College, we only have the housing or the housing building in Terrace. So, kung sino man yung nag-apply for Terrace and could not find an accommodation, I'd be, ha I'd be more than happy to assist in your application in housing. So, I'm a, an alumni of Coast Mountain College. I took up post-degree business diploma. Um, I graduated... Just recently, April of 2021, and um, when I came here, I got the job already. Like, uh, I arrived here August of the 27th, and then you can't start working up until the class starts, which is September 3. But when the class started, I started doing my job. Nakaagad. Tapos, I am working in a fast food restaurant, and fortunately, just recently, last Sunday. I filed my resignation finally. <laughs> After two <laughs> years and four months in service in fast food, in fast food service, um, I'm happy that I have moved on and there's some growth that happened to me. So when uh, last, last August of 2021, I started working at the Coast Monte College. I started as a student engagement and wellness officer. So I was part of the student services. Um, I am the one leading um, student events, um, whatever. Kung ano man ang gusto nyo makita o mangyari sa college, um, just give us an idea and we'll make it work. So we were handling clubs as well. Tapos, um, last December of 2021, before, <laughs> before I ended the 2021 year, it was a bang because I got the job for the student housing coordinator. So right now I'm handling the housing, um, the student housing of the college. So all I can say is that um, there's really a feature here at Coast Monte College. Um, right now I am earning more than um, the minimum amount, the minimum wage. I cannot divulge the amount, but yes, I am. Let's say double. Oh, hindi. Sana nga, sana nga double. Pero hindi. Um, 
it's above the it's above minimum rate but um you see na may ano ba may growth after all so you just have to choose sometimes you just have to um make a decision parang a leap of faith so uh para matupad mo yung gusto mong mangyari and just so you know um just recently we have announced and have announced the student, uh, student advisor Mirin Ordona as well so if you're an applicant um for Coast Monte College here in Terrace um for you to go through with the application you can be eligible even if you are fully vaccinated uh sa Pilipinas as long as you can present a negative covid test results pre departure and pre arrival here in Canada <laughs> Thank you so much, Anja, no, for that very inspiring story. Because we, you know, a lot of uh, um, prospective students, talaga, what they the the question that, that they are really asking, talaga, is is there really job opportunities in the region? And based on your experience, no, and siguro um, with the fellow Filipino um, students na you've been with, talaga, that. As, as I keep on telling them no, that, that there's really job opportunities in our region. No? So um, I think kasi yeah, yun definitely, ang isang factor. Cause, yeah, definitely. I remember when I was a student, I've declined five jobs, five other jobs that were offered to me because I cannot work more than 20 hours per week. So it means if I was able to decline five other jobs, if you were the one uh, nag apply to come here dito sa terrace or here sa Canada posibleng isa ka sa pwedeng kumuha sa limang jobs na dinecline ko kasi I have a job already right so imagine for five jobs na idinecline mo at sila sila pa mismo ang lumapit so it was a privilege to be offered with a job but it's just sad to say that I can't work more than the required number of hours because we have to follow immigration laws para hindi tayo uwiin ang Pinas. <laughs> but yeah, um, all I can say, so far, lahat ng nakilala ko at lahat ng dumating, when I arrived here 2019, wala kami problema sa work. Like, literally. Nagkatrabaho kaagad kami. And at the same time, in the year 2020, um, dumoble, I would say, no, uh, kasi gumaduit ako 2021. Near 2021, trumiple yung number. Um, if I'm not mistaken, it's more than 20 student, Filipino students na andito na. And they all have a job. Hindi sila nahirapan. As long as hindi ka talaga mapili. Um, kasi the moment you're here, the readily available jobs would be from ano, parang sa restaurants, maging server ka, fast food, sa fast food chain. Then you'll work there. Pag sa tingin mo naman na pag andito ka na, then you'll find the comfortability of looking for another job na you think would, ano pa, pag, na makakapag-grow ka more than um, working in a fast food chain, ganyan, na mga um, service industry, possible yon kasi marami ka talaga mahanap. Yeah, so thank you so much talaga um um Anjo no for uh I'm grateful that you are here with us today. I, I didn't expect that you're still awake, but thank you. Anjo, maybe you would want to um invite no our kababai especially in your hometown sa Cebu no um invite them and those who are um students who would like to you know fulfill their dreams in Canada no uh those who would like to study and live here in the northwest region um yeah please feel free to invite them um and also, thank you so much again, Phil Global, for hosting this webinar. We are so uh, thankful since last year, Anja, they are very supportive of Coast Mountain College and very supportive sila sa atin. So yeah, um, invite those um, um, people. Um, well, of course, syempre, unay mo na yung mga kababayan natin sa Visayas region, no? With your language, yeah. you can invite them. Kasi Phil Global Dumaguete is hosting um, this webinar. So yeah. Oh, okay. Dumaguete is Bisaya din ba o Tagalog? Karen? <laughs> Bisaya po, sir. 
oh, Bisaya. Ah, okay. Sige, mag, 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 mag Bisaya ako. Um, yes. <laughs> parang rugama yung Bisaya. <laughs> anyway, um, Sige, sir. Giawhag ka mong tanan na mag-apply uh, sa Coast Mountain College here in Canada. If you have the financial abil- um, ability, but more so if you have the willingness to leap to ano ba, to jump to another ladder, higher ladder for growth, for fun, for nature, for new environment, uh, Coast Monte College, wherever campuses you would like to be in, is the best choice for you. Um, tuition is not, not that much. The cost of living, obviously not that much as well. And everything is here and you get to appreciate the beauty of Canada. You get to experience the four seasons of the country. Oh, mayo kay ka mo bisaya, sir. <laughs> bisaya man yung kayo ko, so mayo yung ka mo bisaya. Go <laughs> <laughs> no, bisaya. So ayun, oh. um, yeah, I hope um, the testimony of Sir Andrew Um, maging reference natin on what to choose na school and ano yung program sa Coast Mountain College. We are so honored this afternoon si Anjo na naka-attend ka for today's webinar. Nasya kami. Meron kami live testimony talaga from a real international student in Coast Mountain College. So, Uh, Ms. Nadine, right now, um, we will cater yung mga questions. If ever may mga questions yung mga clients natin this afternoon, yun, huwag kayong mahiya. <laughs> you can ask questions po. Sige na, magtanong na kayo habang andito ako. <laughs> yeah. Take advantage <laughs> while Angie is here. Yeah. yeah. Um, Sir Angie, right now ba, ilan yung mga Filipino students natin dyan? Um... With the current number of new international students, definitely it's more than 20. Um, with our batch, ano kami? Um, if I'm not mistaken, walo lang kami. Apat nga lang kami. Apat kami nung una kaming dumating. Apat lang kami. Tapos, nung pagdating namin, may isang Pinoy. And then, apat kami. A few months after that, may dumating na isang pamilya, then pangalawang pamilya, pangatlong pamilya. So, we were eight lang. Then ngayon sa 2021, grab it. it's it's more than 20 if I'm not mistaken. Talaga. And it's increasing pa. <laughs> yeah, and it's increasing pa. So, nasistress na ako sa paghahanap ng bahay. <laughs> Nyo? <laughs> no. Kasi, ano naman, um, parang we're trying to build a, a better community here in Terrace. Not only in Terrace, but hopefully all over Canada. That uh, alam niyo yung pagtutulungan. Um, pagdating dito as much as I can, kasi right now very swamp up sa lahat ng ginagawa. But as much as I can, I'd like to help um, looking for accommodation. Ganyan. At the same time with the friends that I have here and the network that I have built, um, we'll try to you know find ways. We'll try to BDO it. Wow, ayun. So it's great kasi yung iba diba sir, pag pupunta ng ibang bansa, syempre hindi may iwasan na homesick. So at least pag nandyan kayo, parang nakupop up nila yung homesickness, yung stress, kasi meron silang makakausap. Ika nga parang growing family na din from different families nga lang. So right. ayun. So um, we have question here sir from Miss Olivia Gilguena. Asya, hi sir Anjo. Were you able to get a job the same month po pagkalang po ng Canada? Uh, dumat- Sorry, go ahead. Sorry, go ahead. Go ahead, Joe. Ah, okay. Um, yes, kasi dumating ako dito August 27. By August 28, may trabaho na ako. It's just that I can't start working kasi hindi pa nagsisimula yung class. It's under immigration laws and you will you will be ano ba hindi mo ifa-follow ang immigration law pag nag-start ka ng work before the start of class so ang start of class nun was September 3 um August ng August 29 my job na kung August 28 August 3, I forgot na the, the number basta I remember September 3 simula na ako ng work oh di ba hindi umabot ng one month one day mm-hmm. lang may work na Oo, hindi yes. nga lang makakapag-start kasi pag hindi pa-start ng classes, 
hindi pa din pwede makapag-start ng work. Pero at That's least, right. day one pa lang, may work na tayo. So, ganun ka lupit. Madami talaga mga job opportunities there yes. in Canada. Especially, we study in Coast yeah. Mountain That's why, um, and And just right. so you know, and just so you know, um, for example, the fast food chains we have here, um, say Pizza Hut, A&W, um, McDonald's. Sa Pizza Hut, majority ng workers doon are Filipinos. Sa A&W, ano kami? Because I used to work at A&W, right? The general manager is a Filipino. Three shift managers, Filipinos. Two shift leaders, me and Marge, Filipinos. Yes. <laughs> then um, another mga workers pa. We're more than 10 people sa NW na Filipinos. Pagdating naman sa McDonald's, the general manager is Filipino. The second branch, the general manager is a Filipino. All assistant manager, no. Isa lang ang hindi Pinoy sa assistant manager. The rest of the shift leaders, mostly Filipinos. So, maraming trabaho dito. Okay, magalala. Yeah. <laughs> that's why, Anjo, I've been, yeah, that's why, Anjo, I've been telling talaga sa webinars natin that, you know, while the population is still small, no, we take advantage kasi small ang population pero malaki ang region. That means there are job opportunities talaga. Okay, so, um, um, yeah, that's what, one thing that um, really that, that prospective student is looking forward talaga. You know? May trabaho ba kaming dadat nandyan? Kasi importante no, talaga na merong job opportunities yeah. sa region. Especially after you completed your program. Yeah. Um, you just have to manage really your time because you have to be working at the same time you're studying. But I have to tell you this. Para maatis kayo. Kasi I think this is what is ano, parang kulang sa pag or sa inu-orient sa mga estudyante paparating dito. So the maximum load per classes is 15 units. So that's five subjects. So that's five courses. Imagine nyo sa Pinas naman, just ko ang minimum units natin dyan, parang 30 units, di ba? Buong araw natin yung pagkakasihan. Dito, with your five courses, ang tawag kasi nila sa courses is subject. Y- yung subject sa atin, tawag dito is courses. Five courses, three units pe- per course. So, ang classes na niyan, usually, uh, ang classes kasi per, per course is three, at least three hours ang class. Um, hindi, lahat ng, hindi lahat ng subjects, hindi lahat ng courses, nagka-klase yung um, professor. Sometimes they would just give you mga schoolworks, case studies, that's it. So, kung nasistress kayo sa Pinas kasi you're doing 30 units, dito, chill siya. Promise. <laughs> chill. Marami, marami kang time kasi nga, limang subjects lang eh. Tapos, um, may isang araw na dalawang subjects ka kasi yan mo. From morning, three hours. In the afternoon, three hours. Then, Ang another three days, ang another three courses, say, kunin mo siya ng the following day. So, four days. So, my fifth day mo, fifth, sixth, and seventh day mo, you can work and meet the 20 hours per week. So, you really have the time. Oh, yeah, very uh, informative talaga. Thank you so much, Andrew. So, uh, yeah, Karen, do you have any more questions? Yeah, so um, right now, mamula na ka ako na receive ng mga questions. I think naintindihan lahat, especially with the testimony of Mr. Andro, at least naliwanagan sila. In conclusion, hindi man talaga yung mga Pinoy. <laughs> talaga. Uh-oh. So, ayun. So, don't waste your opportunity. This is your chance to start your career in Canada. So, if ever may mga questions na kayo after this webinar, chat nyo lang or um, ano lang kayo sa mga respective marketing executives niyo para matulungan namin kayo and then uh, ma-discuss din namin more details about Post Mountain College ayun thank you so much Miss Anna yeah. and Sir Anjo for today napaka informative also, and, yeah also if you oh, have sir. questions also if you have questions about the housing you could email me directly at residence at coastmountaincollege.ca 
or acolago at coastmondecollege.ca. Wow, thank you, Sir Andrew. Thank you so much po talaga. <laughs> That's great to know. So, ayun, thank you so much again for joining today's webinar. I hope uh, magpatuloy tayo for Coast Mountain College para ma-meet nyo na din si Sir Andrew in the future there in Canada. <laughs> ayun, <laughs> looking forward. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Have a great day. Thank you so much, Phil Global. Stay safe. Bye. Thank you, Phil Global. Thanks, Angel. Bye, Anna. Bye. Bye. Thank you so much.